So good evening, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm just checking the date. The 26th, Friday, the 26th of August 2016. Go to intro, and I have a slightly more sombre topic to talk about this evening. So, ladies and gentlemen, I am heading off to bed, but before I do so, um, I just wanted to briefly talk about consideration. Um, I had a really, really bad time with my Year 7 drama class this morning. Um, the teaching staff at my school had a very trying day today. We had a very difficult day today. Um, one of our teaching um, staff um, has just lost a child and I'm actually surprised at how painful I found it. Um, this child was very, very, very young and I death has never worried me that much. I've always seen death as a natural occurrence. It's part of a natural cycle. And in fact, it's can be celebrated. Um, we can celebrate the passing of a family member. We can pass a cel we can celebrate the passing of a friend and we can celebrate it as, um, a celebration we can we can use it as a celebration of their life of achievements of their influence on this world but it really hit me today that when someone passes and they're so young and they haven't had that time to leave that impression on the world to leave that that footprint in the sand to make a contribution it's pointless. It's so, so pointless. And I didn't think it would affect me. And it really did today. And I just had a really bad lesson with year sevens because I'm not picking on year sevens. I'm not saying that they can't, but I'm saying that many year sevens at this age can't think past themselves. They can't think how their actions, how their words, how they affect others. Um, they don't have that consideration. They don't have the that full range of um, empathy to be able to put themselves in the shoes of someone else. Um, they couldn't see that the teaching staff of the school were in pain. They couldn't see that the adults and even older students were having a hard time. Um, so they just continued on with a lot of their juvenile rubbish today. And they just simply didn't have that consideration about how their juvenile crap was affecting everyone around them. And it was painful. It was really, really painful. And by the end of the lesson, I just didn't care. I just couldn't look at them. And I didn't want to talk to them. And it's horrible as a teacher when you look at students and you just think, why do I even bother talking to you at this point? You can't comprehend what I'm trying to explain to you. You can't see how your actions are affecting the people around you. So why should I bother? Why not just wait for another four years until you have those skills to be able to use that empathy, to use that compassion, to use that basic human decency and respect. It was a painful day. <clears throat> it was a very, very painful day. So I'm just going to leave it there at that. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I have a very busy weekend. <clears throat> I have cleaning to do and I have analytical essays to, uh, or draft analytical essays to mark. So peace. And I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs>